Hello everybody, it's me Connie and I am excited. Let me show you what I have come across. You will flip. Oh, this goes into that pack right there. You will flip. Look at this book. I didn't even know I did this book. I was going through some of my stuff and I was like, oh my goodness, I've got to look at this. But I don't have this paper pack anymore, so I'm going to cover it. I'm going to recover the outside, but look at this. It's done with twine. Each page is put in with twine. Is that not the coolest thing ever? I'm loving it. I never did a book in black like this, but this could be really fun, and I want to take you on this journey with me. I am going to, first of all, let me show you. The book is six. The cover is six by seven and a half. And the spine is about an inch, inch and a quarter. So um, this paper cardstock is, ooh, y'all, I'm so sorry. This paper cardstock is 11 by seven, scored and folded in half. I also have some of these from Hobby Lobby. In the, it's got the envelopes and the cards. Well, I'm going to use the cards out of here just in case I want to add more pages. I could just use the card. This would be so cool. Just put it in there and add it just like that. How cool is that? And I would have 10 extra pages. They are a little bit smaller, but hey, it's okay. It's okay. Or I may cut some the same size. I haven't decided on that yet, but what I'm going to do is uh, use my um, little wallet prints, but this right here is, let me see, where did I write it down? I wrote it down. Artie Mays, Artie Mays collection, uh, printables from, uh, digital printables from Etsy, Artie Mays, and this is beautiful i may end up um I, my settings on my printer i don't know what's going on but something is not quite right but i'm thinking this may go on the front and it's so beautiful i just i'm just so excited i can't wait to get started and i think what i will do is take y'all along with me when i do this and i also have some uh, pages from jay lilu i'm not sure how i'm if I'm pronouncing that right, but um, it is absolutely beautiful digital papers as well. I'm not sure. Um, I, I think I'm leaning towards this, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be this one because I have all of these. Uh, oh, look, there's a picture of me and Jennifer. Oh, my gosh. This is Jennifer from... Um, um, Genevieve Designs. I cannot believe this picture is in there. I did not know that was in there. How fun. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, and May May, look at that. Oh my gosh. And Vinny, I can't believe those are in there. I didn't even look at these pictures yet, but these are some uh, pictures that I had downloaded from um, my... Uh, oh, that's my son and my daughter and stuff. But from my phone... And I did wallet sizes. So these will be perfect. Um, this will be perfect for these pages. Look at that. How wonderful. And then we can do some scrapbooking along with it. I think that would be great. What I think I'm going to do, because I have so many pictures, what I think I'm going to do is we'll do uh we'll see how quick it goes we'll do a page at a time i really want to put actual pictures in a photo book with you guys i think that would be great i also have a uh, large album that i've already made the cover and i'm going to make some pages and i may do it like this y'all because i love this it's going to take a lot of twine on the bigger one but i have a box let me show y'all this I have, look at this box of four by sixes. Is that not crazy? And I have another box just like it, and I need to put these in albums. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a, a bigger book uh, for the four by sixes. Um, I think the four by sixes would fit, um, whoopsie. 
see, this would hold one four by six. But, you know, this is my hubby and my, look at my baby, 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 my little baby. She's four pound Yorkie, so cute. But anyway, this would only house one photo where the bigger ones that I have will house bigger. They will house bigger photos. So, um, this is so funny. I can't believe that picture of Jennifer and I are in there. But that's really, really cool. That's really, really cool. So this is going to hold, um, you know, there's a wallet. I can put more than one. Um, here's a landscape. Um, that's me and my granddaughter from years ago. Here's my grandson. I mean, it will hold three wallets if you do it just however you position them. And we're going to treat these as a scrapbook page and I'm going to uh, put background possibly I just really don't know how this is going to go but I'm not going to make every page the same and I'm not going to worry about pictures in order and stuff like that I don't think I'm going to go through this little pile of pictures see what I actually have in here and what pictures are uh, in here and maybe possibly get them um in some sense of organ, you know, organized somehow. These are just photos from my phone, y'all. These are from, you know, you take tons and tons and tons of pictures with your cell phone. And then, um, oh, that is going to be so pretty. And then, you know, what do you do with them? You know, those pictures over there are some from my cell phone. And um, I sent them off and um, got them... Um, print it and now I got to do something with it so this size is smaller from this um these note cards from Hobby Lobby these are smaller but I could add it y'all I could add another page underneath there depending on how many pictures I have and how fun would that be to add more photos to be able to put more photos it's not the same size I do have more cardstock so I could potentially cut another and add to each one that would give me 40 pages because there's 10 uh 10 pages in here now there's 10 of these let's see oh that's going to be a whole lot more than that because if there's 10 times four that's 40 if i add, that would be 80 pages in here if you know front and back oh my gosh y'all i'm not a math person i'm not a math person so anyway, I don't know that I've ever done one with the black, but it reminded me of my mother in my father's uh, wedding photo uh, book. It's red on the outside. I wish I had it here so you could see it. It's, it's kind of falling apart, but the insides are black and they have the little white square photo pictures in there with the little photo corners. And I have some photo corners that I might even use in here. I don't know for sure yet how I'm going to play this out, but I wanted to know what you think. What do you think about that? And then we're going to use, we're going to do the bigger one. The bigger book that I have is the, uh, the, the cover is made with the, uh, Genevieve Designs, the largest template, the A size album. That's how big that next book is. And I think it has the largest spine on it. I will have to show y'all, um, let me see. Let me get it. Let me get it. Let me get it. I can get it. It's right here. So, um, it's too big for the frame, but I, I used, um, uh, coffee stain paper on the front. I followed her and I made this, uh, and the, uh, my phone is way too low for me to be able to show y'all, but the spine is two and a half. Two and a half is the spine, something like that. The book cover is like eight and a half by ten. I mean, this is a really, really big book, but it would house all of my um, four by sixes. So I'm going to do that, and we can do that together. And then I'm going to do this one. And I can't, of course, get this paper off, so I'm going to recover it with this. I'm going to just cut this out and I think I'm going to use this one and um, 
put that on there because that is absolutely beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And then we'll go from there. I think this is going to be fun. And the funniest part of it is, is I don't remember making this album. <laughs> I don't. That is so funny. Oh my gosh. Or scary, whichever way you want to look at it. But I just think it's absolutely gorgeous. And I don't know how long ago I made this, but it is so, so cute. And I'll probably put, for a closure, I will probably do the... Um, the um what do you call it i don't know what you call it the um these little suckers the the metal knobs looks like a hitch post so i'll use that you can also get these at uh, hobby lobby uh this is the paper studio ones i mean you know you can get them this is this one's by prima so anyway, so this is what I'm going to use for a closure with some black, um, some black stretchy. Okay, so I want y'all to go with me on this ride. So the next video, I will cut, recover this video, uh, recover this book, and then let's do page one together. And I will do something on the inside, not quite sure, but I'll get it together in my head and I'll let you know. But I'm so excited. This is by Artie Mays and I am going to more than likely positively use this line. It is absolutely gorgeous and I think with the black in it and stuff like that, it will go just fine with all the black on the inside and it will give it some beautiful color. Look at this page right here. Y'all, my printer was crazy. My printer is cray-cray. Look at that, what it did. I don't know why it did that, but I don't even want to cut this, y'all. I don't want to cut it. It's so beautiful. But, you know, with the pictures on the inside, what I might do is go ahead and add another set of this on the inside of each one so that I can put things like this that I don't want to cover with a photo. I mean, I don't want to cover that. That is just so beautiful. Look at my granddaughter. This was so many years ago, y'all. She is taller than me now, but she's taller than me. Oh, my baby girl. She's such a sweetheart. Anyway, one of my baby girls, I have three granddaughters and I have four grandsons and I have three, um, uh, I have three great grands. How amazing is that? Anyway, this is what I'm going to do. I love this paper, y'all. I'm so excited. So anyway, y'all get ready. Tell me what you think. Tell me what you think. Let's do a page together, and I'm going to do the bigger book as well. So we will alternate and do both at the same time if I can handle it. <laughs> If I can handle it, but we'll do it all together. So anyway, I remember this uh, paper pad. I do remember this, but I don't have any more. I don't have it. I don't have it. I don't have it. And I, and I know I got it at Hobby Lobby and they may have it, but this is not the direction I want to go. I want to go in this direction. I just think it is so beautiful. I can't hardly contain myself. And, you know, I don't want to cover all these pages with photos because they're so beautiful. But we have to do something, right? Look at that. Is that not beautiful? Look at that lace. And then I guess this is a, like a grungy paper. Like a grungy. That would be pretty. And look at that. And then also, I will probably pull in some of um, Genevieve's... Uh, shades of color. I will uh, probably pull in some of Genevieve's uh, shades of color because I think that's going to go well with it too. I love digital paper, y'all. I just love it. So anyway, tell me what you think and um, let me know if you want to go on the ride with me. Let's do this together. Let's do this together. So um, leave a comment down below. Tell me what you think and give me a thumbs up. Be sure and subscribe and you will be able to see, um, get notified, hit the little bell and you'll get notified whenever I upload a new video. So let's do this. And also you can come check out um, my Facebook page is 
Craft with Connie, and so much more. The link will be down below. So God bless. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.